Um, try if to someone tickle you with a feather for 50 minutes. Yeah, there you go. Just yeah. smear some lotion on me for 50 yeah. minutes. Yeah. yeah. Well, I think the cool thing about Rob is there's been times where he's came over and I've just said, you know, nothing's super hurting right now. I just kind of need a maintenance tune up and he'll just kind of get into every part. So it's not every time it's grueling pain. It depends on kind of what I'm going through. But another thing I really have always liked about you and I tell any clients or friends or family that I refer is you you actually try to almost work yourself out of business because you try to tell them things to do so they don't need to come see you every week yeah it's a bad business model but it works well it works because you're (laughs) extremely referable and people know that like you're the real deal and you're going to help them and that you also have their best interest in hand which so many i mean that's what i try to tell them what's what we try to preach is just like i I don't want to hold a client's hand forever like i want them to go on their merry way and like be able to live a healthy life without needing us and um yeah that client education i know huge. that if they keep doing it like we're going to organically get more referrals because people will still see them down the road and and if you know if you help a client help fix them so to speak air quotes but then someone sees them and says hey how's your shoulder feeling bob they're like oh great it's fixed you should go see rob he was amazing uh-huh. um You've always given little tips. Like, what are a few tips you think you can give to listeners that like will really provide a lot of value? Like, I know you've told me to put a little cross ball up on my chest and stick yeah. it up against the wall. Like, what are a couple things at home do you think that most people, I guess injury dependent, but could be doing, whether it's stretching, foam rolling? Is there anything, a couple things you really believe in as a core? Um, there's, there's quite a few. I mean, usually using some kind of foam roller or lacrosse ball, some kind of a little device in that sense i think is great so i didn't um, even have a lacrosse ball i just have one of those red kong balls that works my dogs that works I think it works like well i'll charm. even tell people to use like you know in the gym like where like hammer strength machines where you put the plate on the machine there's a rounded edge to where that pin is yeah. use that like something yeah. and you're gonna pin that just, up against like let's yeah. see